than the book is for the last days. And so heaven knows those sweet kids of yours are going to be on, on the battleground. And so these wonderful, wonderful scriptural admonitions to put on the whole armor of God. You just the, the way you put a coat on them for a winter. You you kneel down and you pray for that child as faithfully as you'd put a coat on or fix their breakfast. You wouldn't think of sending them off to school or off to the playground or off to a mission or anywhere else without uh, without asking that spiritual protection that's every bit as important as their nutrition or their clothing. We share those kids. We share them with heaven. Where you think you're worried and where you think you might fall short, just remember it's a really deep bench. Uh, on the other side of that veil, <laughs> there, there are all kinds of angels uh, riding with their chariots of fire to be a protection for your child. We are given in this church and in the gospel protections. And that's because God knows far better than you or me or our kids know that we're going to be in combat. Some gigantic portion of the Book of Mormon is about war. Well, I think it's because war is the metaphor for the last days and the book is for the last days. And 